please welcome back to my channel and if you're new sending love Mwah! to you and if you like my variety then you know what to do please subscribe to me thank you in advance um yeah so this vlog is about how to remove a background in your picture now this is something that i was really like curious.com to know how to do and then i came across this fabulous website called remove bg meaning background and it is perfect people i can't even lie so basically as you see it says remove background so you click upload This is a previous, hang on, this is a previous one that I did, so I'm going to um, start again for you and show you how I do it. So I click upload, alright, cool. right, well, I'll just do it anyway. So I'll click it again. And it's preparing up. So please patiently wait. Don't forget to comment below and let me know if my how-to video was any help to you. Chat back, chat back. So as you can see, this is what it looks like now. It originally looked like that. And if you just want to blur it, you could just do this, click on that one, click on that one, click on that one. But I don't want to do any of that. I want to remove the whole chair and just have my shoes and my gorgeous cheeky cheeky, who was my little long haired bubba back in 2010. 2010-11. So, how do you get back some of what has been erased? So you click on Erased and Restore. Click on Restore, and this is the brush size as to how big you want to restore, or the brush, how big of a size you want the brush to be for restoring back what you want. So I'm going to go from here. Went a bit too far out. I can always uh, erase again, so I'm not going to worry. And then you just follow it through to what it is that you want to regain back. And as you slowly just keep erasing. And then the fun part is just like you're swiggling, just get rid of all the white bit, which was the eraser. And again, you can increase the size if it's too small, do it a bit quicker. There we have it. But that's not complete because I've still got these bits which I don't want to see. So I have to erase them again. So this time I click on erase and I will make the brush smaller again. And then I will I want to start this up from here. And this you have to do very slowly. Concentration. Concentration. Don't wait a bit out. So let me just put it back in here. This 
that great? Right. So I raise again. So from here. And <coughs> see how straight I can do it. Not that straight, but could be worse. Is that too much? I think so. So let's just see. You just have to keep playing with it back and forth. You know why I'm struggling like this for you know when I keep forgetting that I can actually zoom in. So yes people there's another <laughs> that's another thing you can do, zoom in. I keep forgetting I can do that, which makes it even more easier. So you can see this is my first screen recording video that I'm doing my how to to. But I've been using this remove background for only a few months now. It's just still going to get like wobbly, wobbly, wobbly. Let's try and line it up. Being straight now. straight as one can get it, I suppose. Oh, no. Definitely did not mean to do that. Not the greatest, but I'm a oh, shame. Isn't it? Fun, 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 fun. Oops. So let's see. Uh -huh, this is a bit of a bump there, isn't it? That needs to be done right. That's better, isn't it? Yeah. So then you press download. Download again. Then you go into your downloads. 
and there's the bubble. On a radio one. Tab, radio tab. Loud and clear. And there's the bubble. All under control. Right there. Thank you. So that's how it will sit on anything that you pull it on. So right, let me give you an example. Loud and clear. Do excuse my right. So I'm wanting to do not I'm wanting to do. I am creating t shirt store of all my photography and um yeah modeling pictures just variety and so if i select that picture that i just removed the background to i'll show you what it looks like with applying to my convert with your own um i'll show you what it looks like with the background and without the background. Which one looks better? I do, I forgot that I've done it twice. I think the first one looks better. So I'm going to cut that. Go back to my background removed, paste, and select it. And then bam! There it is. There's my baby. I can't go outside. Okay. So do I want to hire? How about there? That two lines, two lines, and one in the middle. Cutie pie, look at you. All right, so there we have it. That is what it looks like when you remove the background. So I'm going to save this for a moment because I want to show you another one. Product name. Okay. Well, I've, got, I've got to deal with these bits and bobs. All right, bear with me, peeps. Um, product name. Cats. Cats. Right. Product description. Cheeky. Cheeky in shoes. Yeah, cheeky in shoes, isn't it? Cheeky in shoes. So that was her name. Cheeky. Cheeky in shoes. Um. Select a collector inside that select right now. So well, I can do all these bits later, I know. Add image. Add image. Okay. 
but then I'll say it even be adding it yet because I need to watermark it, then I Alright, All right, well that is how it looks like that. I'm just going to save it. I can do everything else later. Uh, why is it taking so long, so long, so long? Maybe because I'm recording. All right, so I'm going to leave it there, peeps. So chat back to me in the comments below. Let me know if my how to remove a background was helpful. And let me know if there's any other how to you'd like me to uh, show you. Thank you and see you on my next upload.